The month of September is Bourbon Heritage Month. Yeah, it's a good chance for you to celebrate the spirit in all of its forms, and doing that for us today is our very own Sam Carter. He is live at Watch Hill Proper. Hey, Sam. Hey, Alex. Full disclosure, I celebrate America's native spirit a lot. Only on the weekends, though. Never during the week. Guys, out here at Watch Hill Proper, where you see this, and no, it's not a thesaurus or a dictionary or any other book full of, you know, word definitions, but it is a book full of the gigantic list of bourbons they have here at Watch Hill Proper. And to the untrained eye, it's chaos. But it's not chaos. <laughs> to the trained mind of my guy, Josh, and his staff here. Now, Josh, this wall, tell me about it. How many bottles are we looking at? What are we looking at? Throw some numbers at me. Throw some stats at me. So we have um, about 40 states represented here and about 1,900 different uh, whiskeys. So it's all American whiskey. That's all it is. It's, so we don't have any vodka, tequila, rum, or scotch. Uh, it's all American whiskey. And so. and and I and I and I'm it's it's all American whiskey, which is very very cool. It's USA. Um, <laughs> but talk to me a little bit about how these bottles. Because in a second here, I'm going to pick a bottle, right. and we're going to see you go get it just to see how it works. Um, how are these? You know, let's let's do it. Let's. Yeah. Um, Let's pick a bottle of, um, you know what? I'm going there this weekend. Rabbit hole. Let's go. Go me the, the, the blue edition up there. Okay. Go, go snag it for me. Yep. And then explain while you're getting up there how it works, the way this is organized. So all the uh, bottles are coded with uh, a code. The code has a state and a distillery and a number on it. Oh, cool. And so the states are in order from when they were admitted to the union. That's so neat. So <laughs> if you know the state the distillery is located in and you know the distillery that makes the bottle, uh, then you can find it. That is so, so cool. So they're, they're ordered in the, in the number in which mm -hmm. states were admitted to the union. So if yeah. you look at it here, so. if you look at this bottle here, it's got just a little number on it, and that is how you guys organize yep. everything. And obviously, that is a Kentucky bourbon. So yes. it's, it is it's the- It's in Kentucky, state number 15. Boom. And then all of our hustlers, we call them whiskey hustlers, so the guys that go and find the bourbon, uh, they, the popular ones, they kind of have them memorized. They know where they're at. But if they don't, if they know the state and the and the distillery, they can pretty well find it. That is so cool. That is so, so cool. <laughs> Guys, this is truly a one-of-a-kind experience. And with that in mind, in the next half an hour, I'm going to take you to an experience you're not going to get at any other bar in Kentucky or really anywhere that I've ever seen. you got to stick around for 6 and 6.30 to check that out. Alex, Carrie, this place unbelievably cool looking. Super really nice. cool looking. Great place to just hang out, right? Yes. It is cool. They can do mocktails, cocktails. They have a wine list too. Mm -hmm. So if you aren't a fan of bourbon, um, which few and far between here, I realize, but <laughs> yeah. they have other options for you. Yeah.